Hey guys, welcome back to Steps to Survival. Today, I'm going to be sharing with you the seven habits that you should do every day if you want to improve yourself and live the best life that you can. These habits are small things and they won't take up a lot of time, but if you do them every day, they'll have a compounding effect and they'll greatly improve your life, make you a better person, and put you ahead of the competition. Now, I'm not an expert on any of this, but a few of the habits I have been doing for a very long time, and more recently, I've added all of the habits to my daily life. So I've really seen how helpful these can be, how much they help me improve my productivity and who I am as a person, and I'm really thankful that I heard about them and learned about them, and I hope that you will also be grateful after this video if you're not already doing some of these habits, and you'll learn from this. So the first habit is a pretty obvious one, and that is to work out. Working out keeps you physically fit, it helps you be more healthy, it improves your energy levels throughout the day, and it also improves your mood. So working out is a really great thing, and it's something that you should be doing every day, even if it's just a really simple morning workout. My workout is really simple, it's just in my room every morning, uh, just involves push-ups, sit-ups, squats, it's very simple, but it helps me to have more energy throughout the day and to keep myself at a good physical level. Habit number two is writing down daily goals before you start your day. This helps give you a focus for the day and keeps you productive and helps you to know whether you've had a successful or unsuccessful day. It makes you uh, have something to work towards and keeps you on task throughout the day. I also like writing weekly goals at the beginning of the week and then every morning looking at those weekly goals and shaping my daily goals around those weekly goals so that each day I can be doing a little bit to achieve that weekly goal and that weekly goal is just a little bit to achieve my monthly and yearly goals and so it helps break it down into little steps. So writing goals at the beginning of your day really helps you to focus and get done more than you would if you didn't write those goals. Habit number three is being thankful. Being thankful is super important. The actual thing that I like to do every morning is I go and I write down five things that I'm thankful for. This helps, especially in the morning when you're groggy, you're tired, you want to complain. It helps you to focus on all the positive things and everything that there is in the world that you can be thankful for and that's a lot of things a lot of people that you can be thankful for so that helps improve your mood improve your happiness and stop thinking it helps you to stop thinking so much about yourself and start thinking about the people around you and how thankful you are for everything that you have habit number four to do every day is read Reading is really important. It helps you be more intelligent. It helps you learn. It helps you relax. It helps your brain to get better. So reading is super great and something you should be doing every day, even just a little bit of it. My goal for every day is to read for 15 minutes a day. And just that much is enough to improve myself and improve my thinking, my brain, and it's really awesome. And you can learn so much through books. So I recommend everyone, every day, to read, even just a little bit, but to read. Habit number five is to journal, especially at the end of your day. Journaling helps you to look back on the day and evaluate it, see how it went, and also write down things that you can look back on later and it's interesting to read later and it's also helpful to know more and grow as a person. So journaling is something that uh, if you haven't done it before, it's really helpful to just think about and evaluate how your day has gone as well as share your feelings and your thoughts on a page and it helps express yourself. So journaling is something that I think you should be doing every day and it's really helpful to help make you a better person. Habit number six is to learn something new. And I don't mean learn something different new every day, but focus on one thing that you really want to learn, like a language or an instrument or programming, something like that. And every day to put in some time to learning that skill. And every day you're learning more and more, you're learning that new skill, and that will build up over time, and you'll be so thankful that even just you put five minutes a day in learning this skill. For me, 
I play violin, so every day I practice violin. That, that helps me to get better at violin and improve, so that's a habit I keep up. I also am trying to improve my Russian. Even though I do speak it, I want to improve my grammar and those types of things. So every day, even just five minutes, I do a little bit to improve my Russian. And as a result, in the end, it will have a huge effect because the compound effect and it compounds and if you do it every day consistently it's gonna have a big effect so just pick a skill you want to learn or something you haven't done in a while that you want to bring back and do that just a little bit every day even a small goal every day will have a huge impact so habit number seven is to meditate slash read something uplifting that helps encourage you more in a spiritual moral way and uh, for me as a Christian that's the Bible that I read every morning but you can decide for yourself what you want that to be um, it should be something that, that really helps encourage you every morning and helps show you that you're on the right path as a Boy Scout I like um, the last part of the Scout Oath says um, that we pledge to keep ourselves physically strong mentally awake and morally straight and so working out is like keeping physically strong uh, reading and learning something new that's mentally awake because we're constantly learning new things and then this last one it's more connected with morally straight and making sure that you're putting positive things in you uh, at the beginning of your day or at the end of the, your day to uh, make sure that you're on the right path so those are the seven habits that I believe you should do every day if you want to improve yourself and grow as a person so one more thing that I wanted to show all of you was this app that I found. Sadly, they're not sponsoring me. I'm just sharing them with you. But it's, a ha it's an app that helps you to keep up doing habits, and it keeps track of those habits. And the app is just called Habit. And on the app, you can see... Uh, various habits you can put them in there whichever habit you want to do and then you can check the habit once you've done it and uh, you can put as many habits as you want and it'll show you a percentage and I'm not sure how they calculate their percentage but it just motivates you to keep doing those habits and you can track them make sure you're doing them it shows you how much you've done for the month for the year for the week and uh, if you do it for 90 days in a row, then you'll reach 100% on that habit. So that can be like a goal for you to do a habit for 100 days in or 90 days in a row. So this app is just really cool, and I think it will be helpful to you guys. You can find it on App Store um, as Habit. Anyway, thanks so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video. I hope you learned from it. I hope it motivated you in some way to add all or some of these habits into your daily life. Don't forget to like the video, comment what you thought, and subscribe to my YouTube channel. Thanks for watching. See you later.